Why have you decided to do Dawah on the street in a predominantly non-Muslim environment? Knowledge is useless unless it is shared. If I learn something, if I don't pass it on to someone else, then what I know is completely useless. You're touching the hearts and minds of people and you're getting them to see a truth. The first time he's presenting himself in front of Allah in the act of worship, he doesn't want to get up now. Very prominent in the field of Dawah. He goes by the name of Abdul Wahab and he's also known as the Warner. Wa well, alaikum salam brother I've been, I've been watching your videos man so I've been watching your videos man Assalamu alaikum Assalamu Are you about to cry bro? Yeah man I Come on give me a hug Give me a hug bro Give me a hug Give me a hug man Give me a hug bro It was fucking tough three months man I I was I'm from Kazakhstan and I was I was rejecting like the truth that the Islam was saying to me and this summer I came here with a work control program and I've been working like for three months and it was it was real hard man. And here I started waking up to Fajr and I'm like the the work started at six thirty every day and I've been waking up like at five AM just to just to <laughs> I've been watching new videos all summer man. <laughs> May Allah bless you, my brother. Stay strong, man. It's very hard, bro, especially in America, bro. Yeah, man. It's, it's not it's, like back home, bro. It's yeah, not like it's, back home. It's hard here, it's man. It's very hard. Everything it's very hard, bro. Hard. I mean, right now, when I started, like, I, I, I wore the shorts that are higher than my knees, even though I knew that I should wear, wear like, lower ones, but I know, I feel, like, bad, but I know that Allah is... Allah is the most merciful, yeah. bro. He's Allah is the most merciful, the most kind. Well, I'm, I'm trying my best, like, to start five times. You call it Salah, we call it Namaz. Yeah, yes, I'm, yes, yes. To, I, I'm trying to like get better May Allah bless Namaz you, right now. Yeah. Keep it up, man. Yeah, I, when I came here, I just want to see you, man. I just want to see you. May Allah bless you, man. Thank yeah. you so much for coming, yeah. bro. Yeah, man. You, you want any gifts or anything like that? Yeah, man, can I get one crown? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, let me give you a prayer mat as well, you know, so it could uh, help yeah, man, encourage can I, you. To... Can I get the mat? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, yeah. I didn't take my mat with me. No, I saw... no, no problem, no problem, no problem. Here, here's a gift for me to you, bro. Yeah. Uh, what what color you. mat do you want? Um, well, I got like dark blue one. Like, of course, go ahead, go ahead, like, go ahead. Oh, this is also like a backpack or something. Yeah, yeah. So it's a bag, and then inside is a prayer mat. Yeah. I've been, I've been, I've been walking by those like with these guys, and I've been, I've been saying the Fatiha all the time because mm. the truth is in the sun. One hundred percent, brother. It's the only, it's the only monotheistic religion on earth. Okay. Yeah, man. Yes, sir, my brother. Thank you so much for stopping by. May Allah bless you and please yeah, remember man. you in your prayers. Okay. Yeah, man. Okay, brother. I'm trying to get better, man. I'm you will. You will. Better. You will. I'm Trust me, bro. Alhamdulillah. Yeah, alhamdulillah. I, I almost said it here when I saw you, man. <laughs> well, may Allah bless you. Okay, my brother. Yeah, Keep me in your prayers. Okay. Salam alaikum. What is this? What's your name? My name's Arthur. Uh, what's your name? Arthur. 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 Okay. Cool. 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 Uh, what is this? Well, what do you think of this? I don't know. What is this? Oh, we're just spreading Islam, showing people about Islam. It's a Muslim? Yes, Muslim, yeah. Uh, what kind of country coming in here? There's no country. Islam has no country. Ah, uh, but somebody said there's no good for everybody. Yeah, they probably lied to you then, bro. Yeah, it's, I think it's a no good for everybody. What you bring in here. Okay. What you bring in here. Yeah, is it nice area for the beach? Huh? I, I'm, I really appreciate that you are showing the Islam for the people, but people are naked in here. How you can open the Quran in here and? Are you are you Muslim? Oh, Alhamdulillah. 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 So obviously I we're. Don't we're don't, yeah. I really like the idea, but people are naked in here. I'm not even covering myself, and I'm hearing Quran. So the people here. who need it the most are these people right here. So if you if you look at any story of the Prophet, they give the message to the most misguided but people. I'm not covering myself and I'm hearing Quran. It's kinda of little bit Well maybe you should check I, yourself then. I wish right now, but I think it's not a nice area for that. Okay, well next time maybe I you should cover like yourself. The idea. No, I'm not gonna do it. I'm a hundred, but I'm not gonna do it. Okay, no problem. Hey, the gins pulled up real quick, huh? Yeah.
سبيل الدموع سبيل مريح تنهدى يا صاحبي Peter Peter okay nice to meet you sir Yeah, no problem. Would you like me to explain it to you? Pardon me? I said, would you like for me to explain it to you? Sure. Okay, beautiful. So a lot of people, they're completely unaware of what the Muslims believe, right? So as Muslims, we believe in Jesus, right? A lot of people, they don't know that Muslims, we believe in Jesus. We accept Jesus is the Messiah. We believe Jesus was born of the miracle birth, right? We believe Jesus is going to come back in the second coming as well. This is all part of our belief. So many people are unaware of this. So I'm just here to educate people about Islam. Have you ever read the Quran before? Cover to cover. Cover, okay, beautiful, beautiful. Sounds good, my brother. But part in Arabic, I don't know that much Arabic. Although when I went to school, it was mandatory to learn Arabic, but I read it English. Okay, beautiful, beautiful. Sounds good, my brother. Well, thank I you so much. It's totally nonsense, like all the other holy books. No like problem. the Bible, like the Torah, like all that. No problem. Yeah, everyone has the free will to make their whatever they choose. Yeah, thank you. Hi there, Asalaamu Alaikum. How are you guys doing? Okay, Wahab, nice to meet you. We'll brought you guys over to the table if you don't mind asking. Uh, you're fine. Okay, wonderful, wonderful. Do you, you guys know anything about Islam? Would you like for me to share with you about Islam? Uh, yeah, can you explain what it says there? I love Jesus because I'm Muslim. Yeah, yeah, because a lot of people are unaware that Muslims, we believe in Jesus. We believe in the miracle birth. We believe Jesus is the Messiah. We believe Jesus is the Son of Mary. We believe Jesus is going to come back in the second coming as well. But one thing is, obviously, as Muslims, we don't believe Jesus is God. We don't believe God is a human being that came in flesh, that was killed by his creature. We don't believe that. You know what I mean? We believe Almighty God is far superior than a human being. Uh, so I just want to educate people on what, what the Muslims believe. Um, and a lot of times, uh, Islam is very misrepresented uh, amongst the public. Right. So that's why I feel like it's, uh, it's our responsibility. Uh, I came to Islam about eight years ago, so it's my responsibility to share the message uh, with the people, because I was born and raised over here, so I understand the people here better than anyone else. So who better to speak to them than a person from this locality? Okay. Yeah. So what, do you guys believe that God is separate than, than Jesus? Yes, yes. We believe uh, Jesus was sent by God. Yeah. As a Messiah. As a Messiah, yes. Okay. So what, how could there be differences, though, between the Bible and the Quran where... Jesus is the only way. Yes. So we. How you doing? How you doing? Would you like some free gifts? Okay. Go go go. Yeah. Um. Um. Yeah. If you want, you can stand over here that way. How you guys doing? How you guys doing? Huh? Well, what's your name, brother? Altape. Oh, you're Muslim. Okay. Mashallah. Assalamualaikum, sister. How you doing? How you doing? Yeah. So these are for the non-Muslims. It's a gift for the non-Muslims. Yeah. Yeah. But would you like a Quran? I can give you a Quran if you like. You already have one already? Okay, okay, beautiful. Keep me in your prayers, okay? Take care, take care. Like it, like it. Yes, sir, my brother. How you doing, bro? Good, good. What's your name? Ashraf. Ashraf, okay. Abdul Wahab, nice to meet you, my brother. Yes, Pleasure to meet you, my brother. Salaam alaikum, my brother. What's your name, brother? I mean, Abdul Wahab, nice to meet you. Salaam alaikum, brother. What's your name? Brother, Abdul Wahab, nice to meet you guys, okay? Um, yeah, guys, so, um, when it, so as, as Muslims, we don't believe the, the Bible is from God. We believe that there is uh, fragments of truth within the Bible, but it's not the complete truth. And in order for you to tell what's completely true, is the Quran is, is the scope that will tell you what's true in the Bible and what's false in the Bible. We believe that the Bible has been corrupted by the devil, um, and it's, it's, it's a mixture of truth and falsehood, and that's uh, basically a perfect recipe to deceive people. Um, so we do not believe, obviously there's different denominations of Christianity, so many people, they, di they interpret the Bible very differently, obviously it depends what church you go to and whatnot, you know, because I used to be part of the church as well, you know, before as well, so I'm familiar with, uh, with that, yeah. But have you ever read the Quran before? Do you mind if I give you a free copy? Beautiful, man. Do you have any other questions? Would you like one as well, my dear sister? It's a gift for me to you. Yeah, it's all 100%, everything on this table is all 100% free. Um, is there any other questions that you have? Would you like for me to share with you what we believe about God? Sure. So you understand a little bit what we believe about God. So, um, yeah, so right here is the original Quran, right? So it was revealed over 1400 years ago to the final prophet of God, right? So we believe that Jesus uh, was sent to only the Jews, right? He was sent to guide the misguided Jews. And we believe when Jesus comes back in the second coming, that's when he's going to guide the, the rest of humanity and he's going to bring the world to peace, right? So I'll share with you a little bit about what we believe about God. I'll recite some verses of the Quran and I'll read the translation for you. If you guys have any questions, feel free to ask, okay? All right. <laughs> 
Kul huwa Allahu ahad, Allahu samad, lam yalid wa lam yulad, wa lam yakul lahu kufuan ahad. So if you guys open up to page 374, chapter 112, it talks about who Almighty God is, right? So 374 is at the very end. It's at the very end. You guys there? Okay, beautiful. So it says, in the name of Allah, the most compassionate, the most merciful, that God's absolute oneness, that He is Allah, one and indivisible, meaning God is absolutely one, and He cannot be divided into parts. So as Muslims, we do not believe in the idea of the Trinity. We believe in pure monotheism, which worships God and God alone, without any partners, without any equals. Allah, the sustainer needed by all, meaning everyone and everything needs the Creator, but the Creator does not need anyone or anything. Would you agree with that? Okay, beautiful. And that he has never had offspring, nor was he born. So as Muslims, we do not believe we're the children of God. We believe we're the children of Adam and Eve, which are known as the first human beings. We are the creation of God, and the relationship we have with our Creator is far superior than a relationship between a father and a son, right? Um, and nor was he born. So as Muslims, we do not believe Jesus is God because God, uh, Jesus was born, obviously, right? He had a birthday, right? He had a day of birth, right? So we do not believe God has a beginning, and nor does Almighty God have an end, right? And there's none comparable to Him. So this is what we believe is the um, uh, is is a, like a little description of who Almighty God is, and this is what makes Islam different than any other religion. It's how we view the Almighty Creator. Like for instance, we do not believe the Almighty the Creator sleeps. We don't believe the Almighty Creator is regretful because if He's regretful, that means He made a mistake. And if He made a mistake, then He's not all wise. You understand what I'm saying? So the way we view God is, is the most high, the most supreme way compared to the other religions. So that's just a little bit of understanding. And then Islam just means submission to God. So in our beliefs, we believe that there's only two choices. Either you submit to God or you choose to rebel against God. And these are the only two choices. And if you choose to submit to God, in Arabic, they refer to you as a Muslim. So it's very, very simple, easy to understand. The message is very clear. There's only one God to worship your creator alone. The one that one that created me, the one that created you guys, and the entire universe around us as well. What about your prophet? Oh, yes. What about which prophet? Who's the prophet? Yes, so we believe that all these prophets are all the prophets of Islam, right? So we believe that Islam began with Adam. You know Adam, the first human being? We believe that Adam is actually the per first prophet of Islam, right? So Noah, Jacob, Joseph, like we just have different names for them. You say Adam, we say Adam. Noah, we call him Nuh, right? Uh, Joseph, we call him Yusuf. Jacob, we call him Yaqub. You know what I mean? So we believe that these are actually all the prophets of Islam, right? Because Islam is the only religion that was named by God. For, for instance, Christianity was named by, is named after Christ, right? Is the people who follow Christ. Judaism is named by the tribe of Judah, right? And these are all what people name. Like people name these religions. It wasn't a religion named by God. If you read the Quran, the Quran claims to be the direct words of God. And God, he names his religion in his final revelation, and he calls it Islam, which means submission to God alone. That is the only true religion from God. Everything else is from human beings. Yeah, no problem, man. I would love to offer you another gift as well, a prayer mat for the Holy City of Mecca. It's all 100% free. Okay, God bless you, my brother. Thank you. What's that? <laughs> سألهم خزنتها ألم يأتكم نذير قالوا بلى قد جاءنا نذير فكذبنا وقلنا ما نزل الله وقلنا ما نزل الله من شيء إن أنتم إلا في ضلال كبير وقالوا لو كنا نسمع أو نعقل ما كنا في أصحاب السعير 
فاعترفوا بذنبهم فسهقا لأصحاب السعير